I am very much interested in things that are going to be immediately provocative and meaningful at the bedside. Let me give you some examples of things that for me are important and I think for you as critical caregivers and potential contributors will find important. I want to hear, I want to publish in this journal things that are actually making a difference at your bedside. Maybe your pharmacist has organized a pharmacokinetic study to show how drug D might be given more effectively. Yeah, that's something I'm interested in. Maybe you've got a quality improvement effort that took performance that was down here, did something innovative, never been previously reported, but got the performance right up to the leading edge. Something that might, that another person dealing with the same problem might say, I've never thought about doing it this way. It's never been reported about doing it this way. This actually makes things better. Uh, I'm interested in case studies that really do reveal a new problem or a new approach. The Me Too stuff, I'm not, I don't want the 20th case study exploring X, but if something is crossed in front of you that says, hey, we've never seen this before, we looked around and this really hasn't been encountered before, yeah, send that in because we might well publish it. We're interested in things that are actually going to help other caregivers. So if you've developed nomograms and calculators and, and things that enable simpler, better, more efficient care, we're interested in those things as well. That's just a very brief list of about 20 things that I've put into this piece at ccejournal.org and exploring the endless frontier to give you some guidance.